Modern brass, an alloy of copper and zinc, is believed to have been invented in the 16th century. The Bible, however, uses the word brass, and biblical scholars explain that this actually refers to bronze or copper. It is possible that Joseph also used brass to refer to bronze or copper. Other recent archaeological findings indicate that actual brass containing zinc was used by the Etruscans as early as Lehi's day, suggesting that the brass plates may have actually been made of brass. As to iron, in 1996, a non-LDS Olmec specialist reported that several tons of iron had been excavated from ancient New World sites. Prior to this discovery, only a few pieces of iron were known. As to steel, when Nephi slew Laban to obtain the plates of brass, he used Laban's own sword made of precious steel. Find that in 1 Nephi 4.9. James H. Hunt, a critic writing in 1844, listed steel as one proof that the Book of Mormon was fraudulent. Hunt, who had lived in the same time and general vicinity as Joseph Smith and would likely have had access to the same resources, claimed that Alexander the Great, who lived 300 years after Nephi, employed iron weapons because steel was unknown. Quote, a coarse kind of steel, or, or iron carbonite, claimed Hunt, came on the scene after 500 years after Laban and Nephi. Even as late as 1920, some critics were claiming that Joseph Smith got it wrong, and that steel was unknown in Lehi's day. Steel is typically an alloy of iron and traces of carbon, that have been hardened by a process of heating and quenching. We now know, however, that deliberate stealing of iron was well known in the Near Eastern world centuries before Nephi was even born. An iron pick, likely dated to the same period, was discovered in northern Israel and has a hardness value characteristic with modern hardened steel. Non-LDS archaeologist Amahai Mazar claims that this pick is Quote, the earliest known iron implement made of real steel produced by carburizing, quenching, and tempering. End quote. Professor Miller is shown here with an ivory handled steel blade sword predating Lehi's time. It was discovered 30 miles south of Jerusalem in very arid conditions that allowed its survival, unlike many human environments in the Americas. Other non LDS scholars claim that blacksmiths in the Mediterranean had mastered the process of quenching iron into weapons at least a hundred years before Nephi.